so we're coming into mid-August all the zucchinis are coming out and my Inca berries are doing well I'm actually gonna get some berries there's a couple right there I don't know if you can see that but that's coming out the melons I'm not sure I've been getting a lot of tomatoes uh, I've been picking tomatoes for almost two three weeks now the uh, cucumbers are coming out and I just remembered that cucumbers are not friendly with tomatoes so next year I'm not going to make that mistake again and uh, my uh, Kentucky pole beans they're all attached to the fence now and they've all flowered so it's just a matter of a couple of weeks I think we'll be eating tons of Kentucky pole beans and I planted about 60 feet of these um, my peas, which grew about eight feet tall, hung over, but uh, they created this nice tunnel here. And unfortunately, I'm going to have to take this down because I think they're not going to flower much more anymore. So it's no use uh, wasting two big plots like that for peas that aren't going to flower that much. I don't think so anyways. So I'm thinking of replacing those two plots today, uh, ripping my hard work out uh, since April with these peas. Uh, we got a lot of uh, a lot of picks out of them though, um, at least four or five colanders full. And I'm thinking of putting kale and radish in those two spots since it's getting cool. The nights are getting cooler. Uh, it's not as hot out as uh, July. See all my Kentucky pole beans. So. Uh, we ate a lot of peas, we're kind of sick of them. The beans are coming next. All my tomatoes are out. I got some parsnips here. Uh, although I think they're parsnips. I'm gonna find out in the fall. And um, in my greenhouse, uh, tomatoes are doing great. And I've got the yellow tomatoes coming out. Those ones right there are orange tomatoes. So that's gonna be nice. And these little cherry tomatoes, uh, they're not too bad. My wife has pancreas problems, and this is pretty much why I'm growing most of this stuff, is to be able to feed her and feed ourselves at the same time, but it's mostly her that's eating the green stuff because it's not uh, bad on her pancreas. But uh, we're getting a good haul this year, and it's not finished by a long shot. I still have two plots I could play with there and uh, these peppers are just starting to pepper up, they flowered. So uh, basically this is where I'm at on what, the 7th or the 8th of August? So um, I'm doing pretty good learning fast. And uh, I'll share another video when all the peas are taken down and uh, maybe those radishes will be coming up and the Kentucky beans will be plenty.